Improving your writing with peer review, synonyms and antonyms unleashed. Hello, English learners. Today we're going to delve into a very crucial topic that can significantly improve your writing skills. We're focusing on the practice of peer review and feedback, and how it can help you refine your use of synonyms and antonyms in writing. Peer review is an invaluable tool for any writer. It offers a fresh perspective, helping us spot mistakes and identify areas where we can improve. It's like holding up a mirror to our writing, providing us with insights we may not see on our own. When it comes to using synonyms and antonyms, this fresh set of eyes becomes even more crucial. A peer can highlight whether your use of synonyms enhances your message or creates confusion. When engaging in peer review, it's important to be constructive and respectful. Start by highlighting what you liked about the piece. Then point out areas for improvement, suggesting alternative synonyms or antonyms if necessary. Remember, the goal is to help your peer improve their writing, not to tear it down. When you are on the receiving end of a peer review, be sure to ask your reviewer specific questions about your usage of synonyms and antonyms. For instance, you could ask if the synonyms you used were effective in varying your language and maintaining reader interest, or if there were points where they found your antonyms confusing or misused. Once you receive feedback, take the time to review it carefully. Look for patterns or repeated issues. For instance, if multiple peers mention that a certain synonym was confusing, that's a clear sign you should consider a different word. Remember, feedback isn't personal, it's all about improving your skills and becoming a better writer. That wraps up our lesson on peer review and feedback. Remember, it's an important step in refining your use of synonyms and antonyms, and ultimately, in becoming a better writer. Stay open to feedback, keep practicing, and you'll see improvement in no time. Happy writing!